Hello and welcome to This Is My Architecture. I'm Joe, and I'm joined today with Bailey from Levels Beyond. Thanks for having me. So Bailey, talk to me a little bit about Levels Beyond. What do you guys do, actually? So we help our clients monetize their media, uh, starting from the camera card, taking it all the way to the screen. Outstanding, outstanding. So you have a lot of AWS services up here. Um, can you walk us through kind of start to finish as far as how you guys ingest that data? Sure. So this right here is our media to cloud workflow. And it starts with the user uploading a file to an S3 bucket. That upload triggers a step function. The first thing that the step function does is kick off the transcode and media convert. OK. What, what exactly are you doing with media convert there? So media convert is creating us a proxy that's going to be good for playing back in the browser so that our user is going to be able to have a kind of visual check to go along with all the metadata that we're going to be extracting. Do you have multiple customers leveraging different kinds of video feeds, uh, different formats? Yep. Um, we have basically every format you can imagine is uh, coming into Reach Engine as a platform. OK. OK. Yeah, continue. Sure. So after that proxy is generated, the step function is going to trigger some lambdas. It's going to extract uh, checksums, other kind of standard technical metadata, and it's going to store that over in DynamoDB. OK. Now, is this just metadata about the, the video itself, just high-level metadata? Correct. Yeah. Uh, you know, checksum of the video so right. that you could uh, you know, validate its uh, Authentic, authentic, authenticity. Sure. Um, it's going to pull out, uh, you know, frame rates, uh, all kinds of uh, media info. Useful for the customer that's going to leverage that. Yep. Okay, got it. Um, Go after all that kind of basic metadata is extract, extracted, we're going to trigger another step function, and that's going to start off in recognition. Recognition is going to take that video. It's going to identify uh, any celebrities, any, any violence, uh, any nudity, um, any kind of data that our clients might want to be able to uh, extract from that content. Now, is that just tagging that information? How are you handling that? So we're going to take all that data. It's going to be associated with time codes. And that is going to go into DynamoDB. OK. Um, after that, we're going to trigger transcribe using that same step function. Transcribe is going to take the audio from that content and translate it into uh, text. After it's translated to text, that's going to get driven into comprehend, where we can run analysis on that text to extract entities, um, you know, un understand things like when profanity is happening. Um, and then all the data that comes out of both of these guys is going to go into DynamoDB. Excellent. Now, do you store DynamoDB data forever, or is that something temporary? Uh, so DynamoDB is a temporary data store. So after the data is there, we're going to trigger a ingest into Reach Engine. Talk to me about Reach Engine. So Reach Engine is really the meat of our product. It is going to allow the users to play this, play the, the content back that they ingested here. It's going to allow them to view all that metadata that was extracted. Um, it's going to allow them to search on all that metadata. It's going to, um, you know, particularly, particularly with recognition, it's going to make a nice visualization where you can see uh, you know, tracks for each celebrity and when they appear in the video. Yep. Um, and then with all this metadata, they can pump that into our orchestration engine, which will allow them to take that content from Reach Engine and, and put it places where it's going to allow them to make money. And that's outside of your Reach Engine platform at that point, Correct. possibly on the client, it's hybrid, or however you guys deploy that. Yep. Outstanding. I love the solution. Um, you know, I do appreciate you coming in and talking about your solution. Seems like a very powerful solution. Um, and I thank you for coming in and describing what that is. Thanks for having me. Sure. Thank you for watching. This is my architecture.